Hey everyone, it's Nina over from Planning in Pink on Instagram. Today I figured I'd show you how my setup is going to look for 2022 in my Erin Condren daily ring agenda. So before we get started, I'm going to go ahead and let you all know that you can follow me over on Instagram. My username is at Planning in Pink. And go ahead and leave a like, comment, and subscribe to my YouTube channel if you enjoyed this video. Also, if you like any of the products you see in the video, I'm going to have everything linked below. Anything from Erin Condren will have my affiliate link, which if you use that, I may earn a small commission from Erin Condren, but it does cost nothing to you. And it just really helps me out as a content creator. All right, let's go ahead and get started. So to start off, I have my um, agenda cover that I made. And in a few weeks, I think two weeks, I'm going to go ahead and have a video up showing you how I made these. And I have several of them. I have them for like pretty much all the holidays. And then I just have some plain ones. And then to go ahead into it, I have this little dashboard here, which works well with the wet erase markers from Erin Condren. They look like this. And so when you write on here with them, they aren't like dry erase markers. They actually stick, they don't just rub off. You need like rubbing alcohol to get them off. So these work really nice on this if I'd ever need to write down some reminders. Then I recently just made this vellum. These are from the Flora sticker book, which looks like this. And I got them out of the page that looks like this. Let's see if I have like a full page of it because I have a few of these sticker books. Yeah, that must have been it from here. I definitely use the whole other page. <laughs> No, I didn't. It looks like this. So it's just gold foil, has all the flora prints. Since the vellums came blank in the agenda and then the A5 sizes, I decided to decorate this one with the flora because it just looks so pretty. So that's my vellum. And then my name page. So I just wrote my name with um, the new Erin Condren earth tone marker in the, I believe this is the mauve color. And then I just went ahead and wrote in cursive over it with my name. And then here we jump right into my six boxes. So these are for the months January to June and I plan to use these as just memory keeping. So add a little memory in each box for like my favorite days of each month. And then I went ahead and decorated it with some washi. And I believe these washi are all from different places. I think this one's Planner Kate, this one's Fern Creek, this one's from Joanne Fabrics. This one is Simply Gilded, Paper Panda, and then Joanne Fabrics again. And then this is from last year, but I just wanted to go ahead and keep my school schedule from last year in here too, because I have some stuff marked on the 2022 side that isn't included on here, I don't think. Yeah, it's not included on this one. So I wanted to go ahead and keep the rest of 2022 on here because I have an important date on September 15th that I need to be able to remember. So this is from last year, and I went ahead and just marked all the days that I have no classes, finals, for important school dates and then the start and the end of the semester. So then here is what my calendar for spring semester looks like. So again, no classes are just marked with that light pink. Finals week is the darker pink. Other important dates are just other important dates. And then the light, light pink with the rose gold date dot is the start or end of the semester. And then we go ahead and jump right into January, which I have set up like this, I added. A little quote here this is from the happy planner sticker book the Disney, one of the disney ones and i added that over here on the side with some little dots i think these are from the um farmhouse sticker book from happy planner and so i just added that down the side and then i figured since i'm here i'm gonna go ahead and add in my work schedule while i'm on here with you guys and then also fill this out since we set this up together i'm gonna fill it out with you too so let's go ahead and get started All right, so to go ahead and start off, I'm gonna be using the stickers that came with the um, agenda to go ahead and mark the days that I work. So I think I'm gonna use these. Then I'm gonna be going ahead and using my Cricut tweezers to go ahead and lay them down on the days that I work. Thank you. 
All right, so that is the monthly view all set up with my work schedule. And again, those tabs are just super cute because all the little foil. Then let's go ahead and set up my notes page and um, dashboard page for January. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do here yet, so give me just a second to go ahead and figure that out. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and fill out my um, notes page and dashboard with you all. I'm just gonna go ahead and speed it up, so here we go. All right, so let me go ahead and show you all the finished product. So here is January, the monthly view. So I just added in my work schedule with you all. Then here is my notes page all filled out and my dashboard all filled out. So again, I added my um, major goal up here and then little goals within it. Same, all for a different category. Then my to-dos for the month, my goals for the month, and my habit tracker for the month and then i'll go ahead and show you all the rest of my planner too that's set up so this is my new year spread that i still need to add my hourly view for and then this week just goes into a cute fern creek stickers sticker kit and yeah that's pretty much it for january so again I really hope you liked this video. If you did, go ahead and leave a like, comment, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And also, my affiliate links will be in the description below. I'll see you next week. I plan on posting a YouTube video every Wednesday this January. So if you like this video, subscribe and click the notification bell so you do get notifications when those YouTube videos are posted. And I'll see you next video. Bye!